Hi there guys, Sean from Five Star Marine here. Uh, good news for you today. Um, we've all been waiting for it. The 7 plus 7 announcement just came out um, from the CCSA in Bangkok. What's a 7 plus 7 model? It's talking about uh, coming to Phuket and being able to spend seven days here or seven nights here in Phuket and then going on to another province for another seven nights. Um, just a few things about this. Uh, this 7 plus 7 model is so brand new that nearly everybody here in Phuket don't really know about it and the rules are still being formulated. Um, as it relates to this model though, uh, what we do understand is that you're going to come and you're going to spend 7 nights in a hotel here in Phuket under the same rules as your current COE. And then your hotel is going to give you a transfer certificate. You're going to take that and you go and uh, if you want to go to somewhere like for example PP, you're going to go and jump on a boat and you're going to use the transfer certificate along with your negative RT-PCR test from day 6 or day 7 and then you can take a boat out to somewhere like PP. Now this is not for a day tour though, under the 7 plus 7 model you must come and spend a few nights out here, up to 7 nights. Okay, and then if you have finished your 7 nights, then you can onwards travel as you like. But if you only spend 5 nights here and you want to come back to Phuket, you must have a flight booked the exact same day that you come back to Phuket. That's the only way you can get back in. So you're going to come back from Phuket, you're going to go to the pier, and it's a government approved pier, and then you're going to go straight to your flight. So here at uh, Five Star Marine, we are SHA Plus approved, which means we can get you out on this 7 Plus 7 model. We can transfer you out to PP, we can take to Yao Yai, Yao Noi, even to Pangnar or across to Ray Li. Um, even if those of you who are, are looking, uh, you can come down to Koh Nai. Okay, Koh Nai is just off the bottom of Koh Lanta down here as well. That's now fitting into this 7 plus 7 model. But please understand that right now these rules are so brand new that the government still responding to it. Yes, the CCSA in Bangkok have approved it, but we have a whole bunch of rules that we have to come up with down here to make sure that we apply it properly. So if you go and ask a hotel tomorrow because you're on day 8 for a transfer certificate, they're probably going to look at you with a blank look and say, no idea what you're talking about. Uh, and that's the, that's the truth of it right now. That's how it stands right now. Um, so I am giving you the most recent information as it relates to the 7 plus 7 model. But uh, my COVID manager, Nat, is here today because we're not going to talk about just the 7 plus 7 model today. We're talking about going on day trips while you're here in Phuket. So pre-today, okay? So pre-today, if you wanted a day trip, uh, it was Russia, Coral Island, Maiton Island. These were the only places that you can go. As of today, okay? We have been told that yes, you can go to PP. Yes, you can go to the Kai Islands. And yes, you can go up into Pang Na Bay. But here's the catch. There's a bunch of rules that you have to follow. And the rules for each spot are a little bit different. Um, so as I said, Nat here is my COVID manager. Uh, he does all the paperwork every day to get our boats on the, on the water. And uh, Nat, uh, uh, it's a lot of paperwork, right? Yeah. Because right now it's a lot of paperwork, so you have to do the paperwork from Phuket to get to PP, and then when you finish from PP, you have to do the, another paperwork to come back to uh, Phuket again. All right. So it's a lot of paperwork, but here at Five Star, we can take care of it for you. And, you know, uh, Nat's looking 30 years older since he started this job here at uh, <laughs> Five Star. Um, so here, here, here it is. Let me give you the rules for PP. Uh, you can go book at your hotel. Uh, you can book direct with Five Star. Uh, and then we can take you out to PP. We're going to take you through a government approved pier, okay, um, to get you out. Um, and when you do go out, we're going to need firstly a copy of your passport, okay. Once we've got a copy of your passport, we need a copy of your vaccine certificate. Once we've got a copy of your vaccine certificate, we need a copy of your RT PCR negative test, okay. And that negative test needs to be negative within 72 hours of your travel. Four. You need to spend at least 14 days on Phuket, so you've got to be on your 15th day. Now don't think you can go on your 14th day, okay? If you turn up to the pier and it's day 14, we're going to have to send you back, okay? So not, uh, how can we check to make sure that every single person is uh, eligible to go? What can they send to us? Uh, you can just send us the passport and then we can check uh, how many days you spend on Phuket by your passport number and then you, we can tell you you can go to uh, another place like uh, different province or not okay. thank you Nat. send me the uh, passport so once we get your passport number or even just like a screenshot of screenshot. your mochana yeah. Yeah. yeah so once we get that we can check and tell you what day you're allowed to leave 
So let, let's assume that now you are allowed to leave. So we're just going back through this list again. Um, so as we said, first passport, second vaccine, third RT-PCR negative test within 72 hours of traveling. So if you are here in Phuket, you're getting tested on day 12 or day 13 right now. You can use that negative test to go traveling on day 15. Okay, don't need an extra test. But if you're already past 14 days, go get a test. Uh, once the test result comes in, give it to us and we can register you to go out. So once, you're, once you've got all of this, then we have to register you to go out. So not there's a group chat, right, where we have to send all these details for them to go out? Uh, yeah, we have to, we have, uh, I'm in the group chat, so we have to to send all, all of that on the all of the paperwork, like uh, one, one day before we go. And then uh, they can approve that we can go to a PP or we can go to the Panga or not. Great, thank you, Nat. Uh, so once the once the paperwork's been with us and approved, so this means you need to book the day before at least. Uh, on the day, you need to bring your Morchana app with you um, because they're going to want to check that we check correctly to make sure that you can leave the province. And if that doesn't show up with the right thing, then you're not going to be able to get on the boat. So these are the rules, okay, for you to get out to PP, Na, or even Kai Island right now, okay. We have been told, and we're not 100% certain on this nut because some people are saying one thing, some people are saying the other. We have been told that if you go out to PP, there is a possibility you're gonna need another COVID test at the PP hospital to then come back to Phuket. But th this this is controversial, right, yeah. nut? Because uh, uh, we've been ringing to the Marine Department and the Marine Director, and we've also been talking to other people in our industry. Uh, some companies are saying you can go and you don't need the test. The Marine Department saying you can go but you do need the test. So us as a company, we're going to follow the Marine Department directive because we don't want anyone to get in trouble, right? You know, like this, so uh, Phuket, Grubby and Panga, so they have all the same rules. So the rules mean you're going to have uh, COVID test, your passport and your vaccine certificates is mean when you when you go to PP so you have to make one uh, uh, paperwork for passport for a vaccine certificate and for a COVID test and when you return back to Phuket just mean Phuket use the same rule so you have to make another paperwork for COVID test but your COVID test you have to taste from all sides mean like you have to taste another COVID test from uh, PP to go back to Phuket so it mean you have to to do a uh, COVID test for two times from Phuket and then return back it mean from PP to come back to Phuket so, yeah. so that's the rules like as clearly as we can state yeah. it right now because it's it, it's honestly speaking it's a little bit muddy here right now trying to work out the rules uh, you know not cuts the uh, cops the brunt of all of my direct conversations because I'm like well, this, this person's telling me they can go and this person's telling me they can't go and this person's saying it's this rule. And the reality is, is that someone like Nard is staying in contact for us on our end. Uh, you have to talk to the Marine Department, you have to talk to the pier we're leaving from, you have to talk to the pier we're going to, so PP itself. And then you also have to talk to the National Park Department to get approval. So uh, this is all a, a lot of working parts. And, uh, and I would say that here at Five Star Marine, without sounding too arrogant, um, we have been running a lot of boats during the, the sandbox period and we're probably one of the only companies in Phuket who truly understand the, 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 the real details of what it takes to get a boat out and back. Um, and we were even the first company here in Phuket to take a sandbox traveler to PP in July. You know, that was a, we were the first company to do it. Um, and uh, it's truly because we do take a lot of time to understand the rules. We read the orders, we talk to the people who are in charge um, and we're, we're making sure that we, we know everything because we don't want you to go out to PP and then get stuck because you can't come back. <laughs> so yes, so 7 plus 7 model approved. Now you can go Yao Yai, Yao Noi, Pang Na, uh, PP, Krabi and even down to Konai down in uh, Koh Lanta. Um, but this is on a 7 plus 7 model so it's not day tripping. It's not after seven days, on the eighth day I can do a day trip. No, because once you come back to Phuket, show your flight, then you're out of the country. Okay, so don't think about it day tripping. Day tripping for you right now, it sounds really confusing, but day tripping is day 15 forward, okay? And if you would like to day trip in the first 14 days, we're back to Coral, uh, Raya, and Maiton Islands here on the map.
Oh, I'm tired now. <laughs> you know, this is the this is like the thirteenth time I've filmed this today. <laughs> Hopefully, this time is right. Okay. So that's it from Five Star Marine here. Have a great stay in Phuket and uh, really enjoy the sandbox. Beautiful day here today.